Well, I made a list, actually, uh, of abuse. You're real that, cool, John. Uh, I made a list of John's abusive behavior according to you. This is what you told us. We, that he has hit the brakes, causing Kirsten's head to slam into the dash. Yeah. And he would do that repeatedly, right? Yeah. He'd be like, like yes. that, just keep going and keep going. True? That's true. Is there any other piece of information that you need to have that this man does not have your best interest at heart, that he goes into a rage and loses control of himself? I, I know he does that. It's just, like I said, it's very hard for me. Like, I've, I've left him multiple times and I've fallen right back. Okay, but you understand that's not normal. Yeah. That's not okay. Yes, I do he's, understand. He's grabbed Kirsten's throat and pushed her against the side of the car, locked her in the bedroom for trying to visit Grandma without him. Uh, Kirsten screamed for help before released. Mm -hmm. He bit Kirsten's lip, then bruised her arm and dug his elbow into her arm and says, how does that feel? Mm -hmm. Threw a bucket of ice and a bucket of water on Kirsten and threatened her with another bucket of water unless she joined him in bed. How is that okay with you? It's not. Well, apparently it is because you continue to be with him, which means you're enabling him. You're not helping him. You're enabling him to abuse you. Kirsten, it's not normal. You know it's not. So why do you stay? You don't need to be with him. You don't need it. Look what he's done. I've been with you for you deserve better than this that. whole relationship, and you turned your back on me, and you destroyed look, me. Look, I'm sorry. You know you have destroyed me. I'm on medicine because I lost my daughter to this horrible man, and you expect me to want him in my life after everything that he's done to you. I can't do it. Can I give her a hug? <laughs> Do whatever you want. I love you. <laughs> I'm sorry.